Uh, well, now this is going to be much shorter intro than we started because we've been talking for seven and a half minutes and Lola realized that she was never pleased to record. Like we have the audio for it. We have the audio for the intro. But do we just like introduce ourselves and be like, here's the audio of the intro that we just said. But it's... If it was 20 minutes, I would understand. Because yeah, like but like it, seven. It was seven minutes. And guys, we went through five, this whole thing. I was about to say, let's just tell what we talked about. You know what I mean? We like, went through this whole thing. We were like so happy and ecstatic. And then I remember the episode was called Ends the Beginning. So <laughs> we're like, we're about to lose Kuropika. And then like the mood just went fucking straight yeah, down. Exactly. And then we're talking about how much do we think that we're going to see him. I don't think we're going to see him kind of at all, really. Where I think that we're going to yeah. see him. Um, because like you said that you think that possi- there is a big possibility that his storyline gets cut off because the manga is not finished. Mm-hmm. And uh, there I, dis- I don't disagree. I just think there is a big, 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 big possibility for us to see him. Uh, I would just, be the happiest person Just ever. because, yes, manga is not finished. And that is the reason why I think his big storyline is not going to be finished. Yeah. Like the big storyline, like the whole continuation of the storyline that we just stopped, mm-hmm. of the art that we just left. But like, I, the, in my opinion, I, again, I don't see the reason because like we are now on episode what? 50? 60? Is it 50? No, well, this is 60. 60. We're watching 60. Exactly. We have 80 more episodes. It's not like we have 30 more. Then I would say we're not seeing... Even if we had maybe 40 more, you know? But just because we have 80 more episodes, I have a feeling like... Because like I don't... Like I, like I said, we started so many storylines, let's say with Melody and stuff like that, where I can see somehow they stumble upon in some arc or something or in between arcs or something mm-hmm. like that we see them stumble on Kurapika and we see something with Melody let's say yeah. or something like that I just don't see a reason why a writer would not let's say put anything off Kurapika for 80 episodes and then write his who's gonna care for his story I mean I'm gonna care for his story but you know what I mean it's not like you grow to the other, like, I feel like you should have mentions of him, you should have him for that, again, I still think we're gonna see Leorio as well, I don't think we're not gonna see them for 80 episodes, and then he's gonna be in the last episode, yes, he's gonna be very emotional, but I'm gonna care much more for the stories of Kiluas and Gons that are ending, you know? That's my opinion. I I have a feeling that, like, we're definitely gonna see them. Like, in my opinion, it's 90%. I mean, I would be the happiest person, but, like... You are at 5%. (laughs) Yeah, but, like, what are we talking about? Do you think we saw... See him, let's say, once in episode 90, and once in episode 120, and then once for the last episode. Mm -hmm. Like, is that what you're talking about? Do you think more? No, I, I don't mean more. I just mean, like, let's say we're gonna have him for a few episodes. Oh... You know, I, I, yeah, I don't think that. Like, we're gonna have him for four or five episodes. We're gonna maybe see something about Melody. We're gonna maybe need her in something or something like that. I would love that. Something like that because I think they're gonna be together and we're gonna find out what he's doing if he's still searching for the eyes. Again, that all depends on this episode and how this episode ends with him. Yeah. Meaning, like, if we, if he goes to search for the eyes at all, yeah. what his plan is gonna be at all? Because at this point, he doesn't even know that some of them in are in the uh, from from Phantom Troop that they are in town. Yeah. And I don't think he's gonna find out because. No. I or so even either. if he finds out, is that gonna be like I'm not gonna search for them anymore? Yeah. I want to go to do this yeah i mean i would prefer that let me just say yeah me too. but let's say like stuff like that i th- think uh, we could have in few episodes and then he continues searching you know i know what you mean i, could definitely I just don't know for whatever reason i don't expect it maybe it's just because my brain functions and I'm like i'm saying goodbye and so like to me that's goodbye you know yeah i maybe don't know I'm i don't know understand. i don't know why i like there is no i don't think there is a logical explanation for like not a logical one, but like we're go. Both of us are basing it on nothing, really. You're yeah. just like, it will make more sense, and I'm like, yeah, sure, but like, then not necessarily, you know. Yeah. So like, okay. Mm. Maybe I'm on. Maybe then I'm wrong because it's like I think I'm just talking what I think I would do because like I don't see a reason why he would not show up. At yeah. the idea. Why would Laurio show up and not him? And you don't think we're gonna see Laurio for what reason? I don't know because like I maybe just because Kurapika was. Always had a more important storyline than Lauren, and like maybe they're just like he's not gonna have story at all. 
I don't know, that makes no sense to me, honestly. <laughs> that means zero sense to me, why, why he wouldn't show up at all. I don't know. I really don't know. But, like, I all mean, I know is that this episode, because it's called Ends and Beginnings, uh, is definitely going to be a goodbye to Lorio and uh, Kurapika. I mean, Lorio, maybe not. I don't know. But, like, uh, yeah. It's not like Lorio so, is going to go to Green true, Island. <laughs> true. I mean, and our two boys are continuing this journey by themselves. They, I guess they have to go through the screening now because, like, they this is yeah. what they've been practicing for. Again, I'm expecting all this to go swell and then for them to enter the game and then for us to see what the fuck is happening and if his father is potentially... In the uh, game? In the game. Yeah, we talked about that in the last episode. Well, I mean, again, it seems like a possible a possibility considering the when we saw him... He was like about like riding a dragon, you know what I mean? And like I have not seen a dragon in this world, so like I'm just gonna assume that they don't exist, and they might exist in the game. Yeah. And so like there's a big possibility that yeah. we might see his father in the game if he's in the game. I think so as but well. Like, that's Especially be... since that scene that we yeah. saw it definitely yeah. seems like that. But I yeah, mm-hmm. I, I just think this is gonna be now you know them trying to get into the game and that's gonna work and then we'll see from then on what's gonna be happening there yeah and the new characters that we meet when do we meet them and do we meet and them in the game like especially the girl i think i think especially maybe some of them were uh, is it in the game what do you think we, oh like do, you to, said that well Did i, I want to say to meet people that also are in the game like okay but not the people who are in the game that we meet the girl in the game oh maybe we do maybe she's oh, like very talented then, then cro- no no i thought we we're gonna be meet her outside but then again yeah well like, i mean uh, yes many people go so at the same well. time yeah i thought so as well but like maybe we also just meet her in the game yeah, i don't yeah. know because like, i don't know if like i think we're, we're gonna, gonna meet her in outside. the game in this entire arc so i don't know then yeah i think we're gonna meet her outside maybe and how does she go into the game with us well, because she's like, one who I, also wants to go through screening or whatever, and or for maybe. some reason she wants to go maybe. in the game. There is a reason, or she's the one who can't get out. I think we're, when we now watch intro, maybe we can notice some sure. differences. But between. both both Finx and Phaeton are in the game as well. Mm-hmm. They entered it. You saw? Yeah, okay. yeah. Because like, why? Well, uh, I only remembered. F- uh, things going into it, but Phaedon went before. Oh, I just, okay. I don't okay. For some reason, I blacked the part out where he went okay. first. I don't know. Nice. I mean, he is the expert, apparently. That's what yeah. they, we learned in Hunterpedia. Very interesting. Look. Let's play the episode. Very excited. Or not. I don't know. <laughs> Always excited, you know? How is it? Like... Even when it's sad, I'm still excited. That's true. You can't just... Why well, you can't just do that? Now we have to see him again. Exactly. This is not a this is not a goodbye with me and Kurapika. What do you mean he didn't say goodbye to my kid? Definitely very saying yeah. Okay. Right? Yeah. Because I thought if it was the whole episode of the goodbye scene, you know? How do you open up with this? This was a game? Yeah, I can imagine this being a game. I don't even gonna see the difference between being in the game and being outside. That's what I expect, you know? But maybe not. Maybe the, the game looks the same as in... I think it looks the same as the real world. Yeah. Uh, just... That is also where we saw now his father, the place where the guy was as well. This place. This mm-hmm. where his dad was as well. A uh, shocking. I what a moment. What does this mean? Is he still entering the game? I don't yeah, understand definitely. this. Why is he here? What? what do you mean? Of course he's entering the game. He's what reason? There. The challenge. It's everything about challenge for him. <laughs> Every copy, yeah. <laughs> Oh. 
ゼマイルからだあいつもまた会おうって言ってたぜえー、ゼマイルだろ<笑>約束通り Let's go get our hunter license, please. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is this your new career path? You're gonna die. You're gonna die. How can you spend your money dead? <laughs> what do you get in the game? What do you find in the game that makes this worth it? I love the things and Peyton just stole one. <laughs> Dragon, you say? Is that it? You just. I was leaving. Oh, these are all the players I want to yeah. Fun! Yeah. I didn't think it's gonna be this big of a. Yeah. They're the youngest, as always. And the cutest, as always. <gasps> we did not meeting the girl in this episode. Money Hunter. He is one of the ones. Yeah, I think I saw him in the intro, right? I think we saw him in the past episode. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's the one that's gonna go back into the game. Oh, okay, okay, that's the guy. 32. And if I understood correctly, like one console, like eight players can enter through it. She said yes, uh, that's what I understand. So they that. have like four. Yeah. Okay, so it's just you can... Makes sense. This, this guy is not moving. He's thinking all this and Gon is like, Let's go! Are we... Uh... I'm sure there's like one correct answer, you know what I mean? Like. But the girl went in. Has anyone gone out? No, no. I would rather go with no, because like this would be everyone's doing this, you know? So like. Okay, makes sense. Uh, why would we listen to a person that just started speaking to us no, 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 and that's our like direct make... competition? Yeah, but like, no, it just makes sense that like, technically, if somebody is gonna get out in the same way, everybody would ask what's happening. その通り、10年以上も繰り返したものがいないとされるゲーム。前のプレイヤーが生きてる限り、お前のプレイヤーが生きてる限り、お前のプレイヤーが生きてる限り、お前のプレイヤーが生きてる限り、お前のプレイ
If you cannot tell me there's like 20 people more talented. <laughs> See, that just tells the potential that he has. <laughs> Look at this here. He, well, he has uh, gone through that, yeah. <laughs> Family reasons. Family reasons. My boy gone. At least he passed. Oh, girl passed. Yeah. Why she said? Yeah, the girl went first. Of course he of will. Of course he will. Of listen to it. Now he's coming in. <laughs> They're my purest. <laughs> the purest. Like, he's shocked. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Okay. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> I will die. <laughs> A contract. He's like the adult. <laughs> yeah, of course. Well, if they die, you have to give them. Okay. The second one could be a problem. Maybe we don't want to give him something for moral reasons or something. <laughs> Me and you! Yeah, yeah but like... <laughs> We should question what they want us to hand over because like a nuclear weapon, for example. Look at a bra. Me too. Me too. But like imagine like hand me a nuclear weapon. I don't think so. Mm. I'm not saying that's the thing that's gonna be happening, but like Look at the, just... you're getting a goodbye scene. Nice. Nice. <laughs> I want to die. Really the cutest thing that have ever existed on planet Earth. The fuck do you look? Why does it look like they're going to jail in a dungeon? Whatever you want. Okay, oh my god. Okay. あ、<笑><笑> Okay. この<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> How is his last name Freaks? Yeah. <laughs> Would you care to listen? Of course. <laughs> no, no. Just let me through. Okay. okay. Two. Book and game. We saw that in the intro. Okay. Okay. ポケットと言います。あ、番号がない。はい。そのポケットにはどんな番号のカードを入れることができます。それをフリーポケットと言います。それに対し、フリーポケットは45個です。指定ポケットに入る100枚のカードをコンプリートすること。それがこのゲーム
Oh. Oh, I like that. Me too. Oh. Oh, so there are more items. <laughs> okay, I get it. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, sure, but I'm gonna forget all this. Is there something? Is it, is it written down somewhere? This. He dies in real life, yeah. Okay, but like we're also dead. <laughs> okay. Well, what is gonna be on the? Ah, that's what. What are, like? What is gonna be on the? He did. What an annoying man. Show off. You know how you would have showed off if you were actually been a father. I probably would find him as you would him on spot. It looks very nice and peaceful. Oh. That's what that thing was. If I was gone and she was explaining this game to me and I would have been pretending yeah I got everything and, and then like hope that Kilua is the one that got it. <laughs> and Kilua would actually got Absolutely. it. Absolutely. I said, oh, this Yeah, I know, I saw yeah. that girl that was braiding her hair and I was like, I for a reason thought it was, uh, what's her name from um, Phantom Troop because she has pink oh, hair. And I was like, how would that connect? What does he say? What does he say? He and his friends made this game. Okay. <laughs> no, <laughs> Translating into Japanese is not for my convenience. I don't know Japanese, unfortunately. My sweet boys. Swiss children. Made such a big deal about this. <laughs> about saying goodbye to Kurafika in the first, like, minute. He says, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gone. I'm not even gonna say goodbye because, like... I need, they need to concentrate on their training, so bye. My child! I don't know, maybe that's the reason why I didn't expect this to be the ending, because like I didn't expect to have the sec like the whole episode of a, of a goodbye you know mm -hmm. what i mean like i but like i expected it to happen to happen at the end of the episode but like honestly i expected the whole episode to be about greed island and stuff like that and at the end kurapika yeah. comes into the room and says that that's he's what going i expected as well goodbye. so considering we didn't get that but like We're even with that again. i thought it was gonna be a one set minute scene yeah and i don't think kurapika deserves a one minute scene if we're never gonna see him again you know yeah if we if the next time we see him is in the last last episode i mean uh, lorio said like he said he's gonna see you again so like we're gonna see him again hopefully sooner rather than later because like you can't i need i him. i agree but like also what i really would like to have is I'm not letting it go. Melody story. Mm. I think it's just such an important story oh, on the day it started. The yeah, I think it's such an important story on the day it started. Yeah. And I understand that they can't have the whole phantom troop that like that is left for later and that like we're not gonna have that and I'm very sad because of that. Yeah. But like I feel like her storyline or something about her. I'm not saying like 20 minutes of a whole arc, you know. Yeah. I'm saying three episodes. A long thing of us finding out where she is and like when we let's say run to Kurapika. Yeah. What I'm saying, I'm not imagining them stumbling up at Kurapika in the one 
yeah. episode all of a sudden, you know? Yeah. Like, I think more like, oh, we need Melody, let's say, let's yeah, contact yeah, yeah. Krapi. You know what I, I mean, mean? They have phones. They have phones, so that's they how I imagine. talk to each other. Exactly. So that's how I imagine, like, they're going to need something. I could yeah. definitely see something like that happening. And I would yeah. love something like that to happen. I want something like that to happen. That would make me feel better. Me too. I really <laughs> hope something like that is going to happen. <laughs> I mean, I guess we'll see. I don't know about Leorio, because, like, it was... Uh, first, like you said, he's less of an important character, and they like to say the goodbye for the next few years, four years. While because he, he has studies. to go and study and become a doctor, which is what everyone wants. From and him. what Melody told him that was such a nice scene. When I Melody, know. <laughs> honestly, that 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 was such a nice scene when Elodie came up to Melody and told her to take care of him. And for some reason, yeah, because like he, he is said very the... smart, but like. He can get impulsive sometimes and not think yeah. things through and but so like, take care of him. Exactly, because you can see how much Leorio cares for Korapika. They've been best friends since... I mean, best friends. You know what I mean. Yeah. They've been the closest... They've been through some things yeah. together. Yeah. Especially because they are similar in age, more similar than yeah. Yudugon and Kilua. Yeah. And it always seems like there were two of them and there were two of the, the, yeah. these two. <laughs> and You say that with such coldness. Yeah, these, these two, two and yet they're my favorites. <laughs> Literally, what I'm talking about. <laughs> So, like, uh, it was such a nice scene to hear him say all of that. You see, he cares so much for him and tells Melody, like, I don't know for what reason he opened up to you, so but he did, so please take care of him. And that was so not nice, in my opinion. And then Melody told him how his heart bit is. Me- this I, melody. I need the melody. The com- like, melody comes for everyone and just gives you the sweetest it's fucking funny. words. And she told him, like, your heart has the nicest melody. That I've heard. Calm. It's like Very calm. Y- yeah. And like, we know this. Like, yeah. we know that Leorio from all, all our children, all our boys, is just truly the one that has like, let's say, the best, the best motivation and just like the best future. You know, just like becoming a doctor and helping people. That is so beautiful. That because is, like, he saw um, a friend die. Yeah. And with some, for, and that could have been prevented, you know? Mm-hmm. And so like, she told him because like he has such like energy calming and kind that he should be like a doctor and i think that means a lot for leorio who wants to become a doctor yeah he was like i think about it (laughs) to get that like validation you know from someone who can just like sense how you are yeah. is that was so nice that was literally my favorite that was my favorite scene of the episode yeah that, that yeah, was so yeah. nice and they have, like, but the also the when they said goodbye to Lori, that was yeah. very nice as well yeah I don't know. To me, Lori got a bigger goodbye scene than Kurapika yeah. in this episode. Yeah, really, like, let's say now, I can't say, at least not in my mind, for certain that we're going to see him until the end of the show. Yeah. Where with Kurapika, I really think so. I yeah. don't know. It just, like, seems like that. Yeah. Unless, really, he's not going to show up in uh, 80 episodes. And it's like, manga was just like that, didn't finish. But, like, just, not, I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm hoping. I don't know if I'm saying things that make sense to me or it's just like I'm hoping that for them to happen. You know what I mean? I agree. I agree. I'm not 100% sure, but like I really am hoping that we're going to see him and both him and Melody again. That would make me the happiest. M- me too, honestly. That would make me really happy. Those episodes are going to be, again, one of my favorites. <laughs> but beside that, we started a whole Greed Island yeah i uh, think i mean our we boys very <laughs> we went into game <laughs> yeah i mean it was very clear cut yeah. it made me i'm very excited for the game i think mm. it's about to be very fun and great mm. and i will see what happens with our boys like physically and mentally uh but like they very early they, they were able to just like pass the screening very fast because like they are the best ever mm. honestly fucking prodigies i just love the different ways that they function like we see we see the thought process behind yeah. um, Kilua, and he really is, he is incredibly smart and incredibly perceptive and everything. And I think we were like making jokes with a Gon being like asleep and everything, but Gon is incredibly clever and sharp and like he figured everything out, but, but, but also he has these moments that are like very human yeah. where you're like, when someone's explaining something and talking in code, I'm like, I don't get what you mean, you know? And then like Gon says, I don't understand. <laughs> like Gon is going to voice that, you yeah. know? But like also when he needs to think about a certain situation, like when they were in the, when they were sitting down, he got it. Yeah. You know, he is incredibly, incredibly smart 
and just capable and emotionally smart and like the best boy along with Kilua and Kurapik and Lori. <laughs> Again, they're all literally best boys. Yeah, I, I, love, just... I love all those. I love everything about our boys. Literally. Like, I, I really love how uh, smart, perceptive and everything the Kilua, Kilua is. I love how we see his thought process yeah. and I always impresses me because I think impresses me because that's not something I thought of. I, I, expected in the beginning of a sh- of the show at mm. all i don't know why you know but like it just i didn't expect him to be this yeah. smart honestly you know like when you think about it, it makes sense that he would be like the 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 smartest yeah. one yeah considering how he has grown up and like who yeah. his family yeah. is and that from a very young age and, he was and, sort that, of... and uh, exactly and that from the beginning everybody of her his family was like he is the next prodigy he is the next head of a family you yeah. know and stuff like that and yet he has older brothers yeah uh, you know, yeah. but like he saw, uh, he showed much more potential, let's say, than them. Yeah, yeah. Which is incredible, if you ask me. Yeah. Um, and I also love that he sees himself as a hunter, even though he's not one. He never managed to pass the exam, yeah. but like he learned everything that Gon did. And he completely yeah. sees himself as a hunter. Yeah, that's much more important uh, than how he feels. Exactly. Like he is if really... he has the card, if he doesn't have a yeah. card. Like, he is really going against, and we have seen this before. Yeah. Uh, in, like, one of the previous episodes, it was also, I think, his father's voice, I think, when he is saying something, uh, and we see that Kilo is doing the opposite of that. It's so usually, it's really kind of shedding his teachings. Exactly, but it, it's usually just because he's shedding them because of gone. It's yeah. somehow always like that, but in this yeah. episode, it wasn't just, it was about yeah, him. It was about and him, I, I love well, that. Yeah, I really love that. Because I'm not an assassin, I am a hunter. Like, I have I made cry. my own, literally, because like that's cry. why he like left his family. He was yeah. like, my, my future is basically predetermined for me. Yeah. I'm like, I don't want to do what you want me to do. Like, I don't yeah. want to... Like, maybe I want to do that, but like, I don't know, you know, yeah. like I have not been, been yeah. given a choice yeah. to think what I want to be and who I want to be. And so like for him to be like, I'm not an assassin, I'm a hunter because like hunter is a state of mind. You don't need the card. He exactly. is a hunter. Exactly. He is a hunter. Exactly. And like, we don't, it's fine without a card, God has a card. So any information we might need, God has it, we're good. And they are together. And yeah, so that. like it's a package deal. This, exactly. this card might as well be theirs. You know, like it's, <laughs> exactly. it's, a, it's they're, they're sharing it. <laughs> exactly. And so I just, I just, I love that moment. Me too. And then Gon just like made a fucking hole in the wall and saw Kilo. He's like, ah, there you are. <laughs> they're they are, so I can. Pure. They're so adorable. They're uh, whenever so we see them, they're adorable. But like, yes, I want to just mention we uh, when Gon then afterwards went in because you said like he always voices things, you know. Mm. But like, I just love how they always put comedy through Gon somehow. Yeah. You know, like yeah. always, even in that scene, him yeah. not understanding, I don't understand. Gon, we on the same page, boy. Literally, we completely on the same page god when people start like i i don't know why my mind at times when i need to listen most i listen least it's not when like i listen start... <laughs> it's just like it, those are the birds no they don't go together somehow in my brain i don't know how to explain I, when that I, when i over concentrate on things i don't understand them exactly. at all if i was Let's to just say... be watching and not thinking too hard about it it'd be exactly. fine exactly but when i feel like now i need to understand this it's nothing. nothing then it's like i'm reading words and not connecting nothing's them. happening I don't in know my brain I mean. that's exactly but like it's exactly the same when we are reading on paper how the game is played yeah i don't i, I don't understand yeah. Yeah. but like then we go on youtube and we see uh, how I'm, somebody I'm a visual else, learner. Yeah, so how, how somebody else explains actually yeah. shows you with all those things. Yeah. Of course, I'm not that. No, you know? like sometimes things just don't click to me. Like whenever we are like playing a board game yeah. and like someone's figuring it out and they like tell you, I'm like, I guess I'm gonna figure it out as we go. As we go, those and are I, my I just, favorite I, I just things. guess I'm gonna Literally. figure it out as we go because like I might understand you to some degree, <laughs> and the things that I don't really understand, I guess I'm gonna get while we play. Exactly. And I just gone. I just I just love it. It seems so much more human that in these like moments that are like not important at all. Gone's like. I don't, I'm not sure if I understood what you said because like it seems like those are the things that I think of sometimes when we watch the show but like all the characters always understand everything and like there is no yeah. question about it and the gone's like, I'm not sure if I got that. <laughs> I can't tell you for certain, no. <laughs> and like, you know, when he was speaking to in the previous episode or whatever, he's speaking to the teacher and the teacher's talking in code and I'm like, I don't know what you're yeah, trying yeah. to tell him and gone's like, give me a hint. <laughs> give me a hint because like I don't, I can't understand. Yeah. 
Uh, I, that's one of my also my my most favorite things about a show yeah. because like it seems so very human because yeah, of that. Yeah, I agree. And after that, we found out that Jink yeah you know, left a message for him. I wish he didn't. <laughs> what a fucking I asshole! Every time I hear his voice, I cannot. I want to go in the game and shoot him. Honestly, <laughs> he's so I he's annoying. I can't. God, that smug face. That smug. I, like he just seems smug. He's like, I just wanted you to show. I wanted to I show, want to show up, up what I game. made. Fuck you. Yeah, me and my friends. Uh, have s- have a good nice time. Uh, there is nothing about my location here, but have a nice time playing. Fuck you. I'm yeah, surprised God, God didn't just turn his head around and went in the opposite direction. I was like, okay, Lord, this well, is a waste of fucking time. Now he can. Exactly. Now he fucking can. And why can't he? He might because be his stuck father in here forever. Him. What if your son wasn't a prodigy? Do you think he deserves to die? <laughs> Apparently he does. I mean, if he wasn't a prodigy, he wouldn't be able to get into If he end. wasn't a prodigy, he would have died in the hunter exam. He mm-hmm. would have still died. If he wasn't a prodigy, not a prodigy, but like if he wasn't as talented as he was, so many of them like died mm-hmm. during the hunter exam. He would have fucking died. I I, don't, I think he wouldn't pass the running game, you know. <laughs> True, but he might die because. Of the <laughs> Whatever. I just want to make. I just want to make sure that we all know that his father does not care about his well being. If he is I think good. that is very. I just want to. I just want us to make sure that we all got that. That I we're think all everybody on the same page with that. I think everybody knows that, that. we are all on the same and page. And if with somebody is not the, the, that person, is like you said, watching the show on his on their phone, you know, like okay. watching the show and actually not while not understanding it. Japanese. <laughs> like, you can't even say that like oh, I'm just, I'm at least listening to it. Nothing. No. Exactly. No, because like there is I just, <laughs> I just like we need to I think show is not hiding it at all. I think show is making it pretty obvious. Okay, you know? When I see fucking Jane's face. Oh, what an annoying fucking person. Yeah, I thought I definitely don't think now that we're gonna see him in, in this arc in next few episodes well yeah i don't, I don't think so either but also i fucking don't know i mean like uh, when we first saw him he might have been in the game yeah, and stuff like that exited. but he could have exited i think he's one of those who can go in and out well, whenever I mean, he, he made wants. the game exactly look at least he gave his son the i mean the pre-safe so you can hear a couple of words from this like oh nice narcissist <laughs> like hmm, let me like walk you through this but like actually do nothing <laughs> Like I'm showing off. <laughs> like like what? This is like, like psychotic behavior. Yeah. Honestly, what the fuck is that? <laughs> okay, guys. Like, this it. is great. I'm Thank so you excited. So much for a second. We saw the girl. We saw the girl for yes. a second. But I guess we're gonna meet. Everyone her in the else, next honestly, episode. I don't recognize them. I'm so yeah, sorry from the intro. I need to look at them again. I don't yeah, recognize anyone. Yeah. Okay. Thank That's you so it. much for watching. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.